Tell me about Call of Duty and why you're a fan. I'm a fan just because, you know, it, it's been around for so long. It's one of the best, like, you know, first person shooter games, you know, ever well, to, you know, start off. And then, you know, it just kind of just gets better year after year. So it's interesting because I knew you were a gamer because I follow you on social, and yep. you and Josh Hart, your former teammate, yep. would go back and forth, mm -hmm. and, it, and the, it was intense. The trash talking was really uncomfortable. The kids were uncomfortable as well. Oh, yeah. Yeah, the me, kid, yeah. Oh, okay. So, <laughs> so or do you play with other players? Uh, from time to time. Like, I played with Josh before, so before. Um, you know, that's kind of really it. You know, I kind of just stay with my teammates, well, ex-teammates. Right, but, right. You know, to play with them, so. Tell me why you're a fan of Call of Duty. One, it brings my husband and I together. Um, obviously, he loves video games, so it was one of those things that at first I, I couldn't really get him away from him, so I decided you can't beat him, you join him. <laughs> um, but now it's like fun. It's something that we can kind of do together. He obviously plays multiple types of games, and basically Call of Duty is the only game I can play. You love it, right? Yeah, I do really enjoy the game. I used to play it a lot, especially in college, high school. It was a way for you to bond with your friends. It was a way for you to, and it was cool because it taught you teamwork yeah. and um, taught you how to lead. You know, the, my parents obviously would try to limit our time on the screen, but with how esports are going these days, I made a great investment all those years playing Call of Duty. And when my athletic career is over, who knows? I could be an esports gamer. Like the Yo, athletic career could just keep going. You led me there. Not to I, disrespect those guys, because they are truly amazing what they no, do. No, I was thinking that. I was like, I played, is it? I played a lot. I got but my But don't you think in. you could be professional at this if you wanted to? Some say it takes 10,000 hours to become a pro in whatever respective field you do. And I think I've logged 10,000 <laughs> Call of Duty hours. Like, I'm pretty sure I have in my life. So I'm not a pro, but I, I can call myself a semi-pro. I feel confident saying that. So you've logged 10,000 hours gaming. I think, yeah, Sad, not sadly because, like I said before, it's a good investment with the way esports are going and how you can really make a job out of it. And like, there's such a with Twitch now, it's crazy the streaming. So yeah, I've easily logged 10 hours gaming. Wow. And athletes love the game. That's I was going to say you guys love it. They love Do you it. play with some of your teammates? Yeah, I mean, as I get older, guys starting to have family, so we're losing <laughs> soldiers left and right. But when I was younger, we would game a lot. Whether it was FIFA, Call of Duty, it was so fun just to compete. And for us, we know some of us like to get away from the competitive fields, but some of us can't stop doing it. And Call of Duty was just another way to talk mess with your friends and bond over gaming. And you said it taught you a lot about sports too. It but did. I, I'm thinking like while you're rehabbing, how many how many hours are we logging in gaming? Man, I only try to keep an hour every other day because it can get out of hand. <laughs> you get, if you get on a roll, it's just like basketball. You get in a zone of Call of Duty, you can have a kill to death ratio of like 30 to 5, and then you feel so empowered to keep going all day, like you're in the zone, just like hoop. When you score 50 in a game, you want to play again because you got that hot hand. Mm -hmm. Same thing with Call of Duty, but you got to have self control of strength. And I didn't have that much growing up with Call of Duty. I would play long hours in the night, but as an adult now, I try to keep a good balance because it can be very addictive. Thanks for watching ESPN on YouTube. For more sports highlights and analysis, be sure to download the ESPN app. And for live streaming sports and premium content, subscribe to ESPN+.